from the gospel according to john chapter 10 verses 22 to 30 the feast of the dedication was taking place in jerusalem it was winter and jesus walked about in the temple area on the portico of solomon so the jews gathered around him and said to him how long are you going to keep us in suspense if you are the christ tell us plainly Jesus answered them I told you and you do not believe The works I do in my father's name testify to me but you do not believe because you are not among my sheep My sheep hear my voice I know them and they follow me I give them eternal life and they shall never perish No one can take them out of my hand My father who has given them to me is greater than all and no one can take them out of the father's hand the father and i are one the image of the shepherd and the sheep indicates the close relationship that jesus wants to establish with each one of us he is our guide our teacher our friend our model but above all he is our savior In fact the following expressions from the gospel passage affirm I give them eternal life and they shall never perish and no one shall snatch them out of my hand Who can say that only Jesus because the hand of Jesus is one thing with the hand of the father and the father is greater than all These words communicate to us a sense of absolute security and immense tenderness our life is fully secure in the hands of jesus and the father which are a single thing a unique love a unique mercy revealed once and for all in the sacrifice of the cross to save the lost sheep which we all are the shepherd became lamb and let himself be immolated so as to take upon himself and to take away the sin of the world In this way he has given us life life in abundance This mystery is renewed in an always surprising humility on the eucharistic table It is there that the sheep gather to nourish themselves It is there that they become one among themselves and with the good shepherd Because of this we are no longer afraid Our life is now saved from perdition. Nothing and no one can take us from the hands of Jesus. Because nothing and no one can overcome his love.